In my previous video, I've played Minecraft on this old laptop, so now I'm gonna try to optimize this laptop to squeeze out the most FPS as possible. Alright, so we're finally back in this laptop, and it's been a very long time, I know, right? So, you know what? Let's just test some performance. And of course, it's 1.8.9. Okay, so in my previous video, I forgot to uh, create a new world and just test the FPS and do the F3 FPS test, which I forgot. Sorry for about that. So we're going to be checking. Okay, and there we go. Oh my goodness. Okay, it immediately lagged at the starting. And y'all might be wondering, why am I not screen recording? Well, uh, apparently, when I screen recorded in this laptop, uh, my FPS drained a lot. So without screen recording in this laptop, uh, my FPS feels a lot more smoother when I'm not recording in the computer. And don't worry, the FPS is optimized. But anyways, let's see the FPS. Oh my goodness, I'm... I'm getting around 70 to 80 FPS. I'm getting 52 and 42 now. My FPS is literally 100 when I'm just moving around. But my game feels a little bit stuttery as well. So yeah, that makes sense. But hey, that's a massive difference when I record it from screen recorder and just playing it without screen recording. That's a pretty big difference right there. And yes, this is vanilla, okay? I'm literally playing in two chunks and the FPS still fluctuates on this one. First, let's just enable game mode in Linux. So for that, let's just go to our Firefox browser and let's search enable game mode for Linux. Okay, apparently I see this website which tells us to enable game mode and Linux Mint is based on Ubuntu. So yeah, let me just do that. So let me just copy these commands and let's open terminal. Yeah, I forgot to do the typical Linux stuff, which is terminal in my previous video. Not sure why, but uh, okay, let's just paste and okay. Uh, I don't mean to get this weird symbols in my terminal. So you know what? Let's just click enter. All right, so let's go. Let's just, okay. It says that game mode is already installed. Okay, I did not know X-Face Linux Mint would already install game mode. Well, that's good. But you know what? Let's just install Optifine just for the 1.8.9 version. All right, there we go. Optifine for 1.8.9. Okay, so apparently I'm going to go to my file explorer and go to downloads folder, which I install Optifine in. To right click properties, selecting it as a file to run as a program. So let's open it. And there we go, the window. All right, so of course, I'm gonna install it. Optifine is successfully installed, let's go. Now let's open Minecraft Launcher. So I finally see Optifine here, so let's just play. And yeah, I don't care about the risks. This is obviously a safe one. Okay, so we are finally in the Optifine version of our Minecraft world. Apparently, I am getting really, really good FPS with this one, which is extremely awesome, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, let's see without the hint. And as you can see, it the game is just playable as usual. I like that actually it's very awesome but anyways let's try this in servers so let's try in my men and let's play some fireball fight and now i remember last time i literally lost badly because the game was so laggy when i just did not install optifine and i was screen recording at the time so i'm doing this without a uh, screen recording and let's see if i can win at least one game in this laptop at least okay so i gotta jump from here as well all right bottom beam bada bam Okay, there we go. Oh my, okay, I see some stutters. Uh, I, I experienced some stutters while bridging. Oh no, wait, hold on, why was I bridging? I gotta go to the void. I have not played Mindman for a really long time, consistently, if you all know, by the way. Okay, there we go, actual PvP fight. No, oh, there we go, that gives me an opportunity. No, that was an accident. Okay, prepare. Um... Dang, I ha I have my chance. Oh no, this idiot. There we go, got your bed, buddy. There we go, let me go to the void and hopefully not, you know, die. Let's go, I won the match, oh my goodness, for the first time in this laptop. Dang, yeah, so that, this laptop is really playable right now. My FPS fluctuates in the lobby, I don't know why. It's still better than before, which I really like about. Okay, so there is our 1.8.9 optimization texture pack, so let's go. Dang, my game froze in Linux while I was optimizing the extra settings in Linux. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna click on the Windows key, and then I'm gonna search Task Manager. 
And then this looks very similar to Windows and it's it's a bit UI friendly as well. As you can see, the results are quite better than Windows. I mean, ignore the 72%, this is just Minecraft running, but in default, it runs better. But anyways, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna scroll down, I'm gonna click on Minecraft and I'm gonna kill the process because the stop doesn't work for some reason. It's gonna say it's crashed, but we actually just killed it in the task manager, which is pretty funny to see. Okay, okay, I do not know if this is 8x texture pack or 1x. Nah, that looks weird. Okay, anyways, let's just see our FPS with this. Okay, that is much, much better. I mean, I only see a little bit of difference and that's it. Okay, right now the FPS right now is really, really good. So much better than the vanilla one. I'm consistently getting 100 FPS, which is way better. Optifine plus this texture pack. Oh Lord, finally, I'm able to play Hypixel normally and, and without any lag. Okay. I know, um, oh. now keep in mind y'all, I am not good at Hypixel at all cause like it's very competitive and uh, I'm a bit of a noob in this game so I'll try my best to play good at least. Oh no. Okay and there we go, my first bed destroyed in this, in this game, I guess. <laughs> Okay, there are some bugs in Linux. So when I, whenever I press these hotkeys, as you can see, like I'm like I'm literally pressing right now, it always delays when I switch to them. Like when I need to switch them, it doesn't work. Okay, there we go, bridging. Uh, I did best though. Oh, uh, my bed got destroyed. Okay, let's go, a real PvP match. Okay, let's see if I can win this PvP match. Bed fight in this game. All right, let's see. No! Wait, what was that sound? Is it from the texture pack or is it from the laptop? Because that sound looks very, very strange. Okay, there we go. The bridging. Where's that person? Alright, this person's coming, so let's go. Oh, don't do that, please. Hey. Okay, fine. Oh, come on. Hey, no. Don't. Don't destroy. No, my bed got destroyed, but at least I got a kill. But hey, at least it performs well. In my last video, I've said that I'm, I'm not, not confident, confident enough, enough that for this game to perform well in latest version. Well, guess what? All right, so we're finally back in Minecraft Java 1.21.4. And I don't know why the background is black and white. It looks like Minecraft beta. But anyways, let's just optimize the settings and let's see. Still running smooth like like normal with that lower settings without optifying like let's just see okay 26 fps that's like 30 fps okay and when i move around it's 40 fps that's confusing it's still consistent at 30 fps which is interesting it looks all right so what I'm going to do is I'm going to be installing not Optifine because apparently Optifine runs worse on latest versions of Minecraft. So I'm going to be installing Sodium. So I've installed Fabric Launcher from this website and then I am going to be installing. Yes, you know what I mean. And then there you go. And then let's install. Okay, there we go. So uh, does that mean I'll be able to install Sodium like that? LOL! Alright, I have finally gotten Fabric Loader in Minecraft, so I guess that means we got Sodium in Minecraft, so let's see. We have finally gotten Fabric Mod in Minecraft, and that means we got Sodium, so let's see. Oh wow, that looks very, very awesome. I like that UI. Okay, I do not know what happened here, but yeah, this is how the performance is right now, and yeah, it's very, very fluctuating. That's weird that in Vanilla, it was running just fine, in Sodium, it's running a bit laggy, but hey, that's just Linux. Because Linux acts weird sometimes. But yeah, let's just go on modern 1.21 servers like MCC Championship. Alright, so we are in MCC Island and holy moly. With Sodium, it is very laggy. But only in the lobby. Which is no surprising to see because every server lobby is lag a lot. Um, we're getting 33 FPS, which is nice, I guess. But anyways, let's just go on, I don't know, like Sky Battle. It's quite playable though, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, so there we go on Sky Battle, and apparently we are gaining some really good FPS, like 68, 51, or 40 FPS. Let's go. Okay, so only this one. Alright, so this is our island, okay. Apparently we're getting 85 FPS. This is like really, really good. Especially for a laptop like this. It looks so good. 
Okay, what's in the chest? Okay, I do not know what is that. Like, what are these items? Potion of regeneration or something. Hold on, is this an enemy? Okay, I forgot. This is the enemy. Oof. No, these are like two people, dude. What the? Nah, bro. Uh oh. No, come on. Okay, I'm not really used to this PvP, but I'll try my best to play. Okay, there we go. We got some enemy. Oh my goodness, that's a lot. Okay. No! Okay, I'll try to like bridge. And I really don't know what to do about this right now. Okay, and uh, I guess let's just try to find some people here. Where are, are the bad guys? Hold on. Is this a bad guy? That looks like one. Hold on, let me just see. There we go. Oh my goodness, that was so close. Okay, there we go. Wait, hold on. Why was I hitting with my bow? That's weird. Oh my goodness, block that lava. Oh my goodness, let me just let me just eat some steak. Oh no, that's not good. Oh no, what is this guy doing? Yo, dang it. Watch this video of me playing Minecraft on this laptop. And if you're new here, subscribe so we can hit 20k subscribers. And like always, peace out, clabs.